Hey y'all, welcome back. I hope you're having a good Thursday. It's time for our daily poetry reading. Today I'm going to read a poem by James Whitcomb Riley. He was a wildly popular poet in his time uh, and was typically referred to as the children's poet. When he passed away, Edgar Guest, another poet, wrote a poem in tribute to him. But this is a poem of his called Old Aunt Mary's. Wasn't it pleasant, O oh brother of mine, in those old days of the lost sunshine of youth, when the Saturday's chores were through, and the Sunday's wood in the kitchen too, and we went visiting me and you, out to old Aunt Mary's? It all comes back so clear today, though I am as bald as you are gray, out by the barn lot and down the lane, we patter along in the dust again, as light as the tips of the drops of rain, out to old Aunt Mary's. We crossed the pasture and through the wood, where the old gray snag of the poplar stood, where the hammering redheads hopped awry, and the buzzard raised in the clearing sky, and lolled and circled as we went by, out to old Aunt Mary's. And then in the dust of the road again, and the teams we met, and the countrymen, and the long highway with sunshine spread as thick as butter on country bread, our cares behind, and our hearts ahead, out to old Aunt Mary's. Why, I see her now in the open door, where the little gourds grew up the sides and o'er, the clappered roof, and her face, ah, me, wasn't it good for a boy to see, and wasn't it good for a boy to be out to old Aunt Mary's? And oh, my brother so far away, this is to tell you she waits today to welcome us. Aunt Mary fell asleep this morning, whispering, tell the boys to come, and all is well, out to old Aunt Mary's. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you have a great day. Stay healthy. Stay well. We are all in this thing together.